The seaplane industry, not unique to the Bahamas. In fact, Atlantis Paradise Island Resort anticipates adding daily seaplane flights to the family islands real soon. But as Alta Vista Mullings tells us, public inputs needed before they can take flight. It's been several years now since seaplane traffic dominated eastern New Providence. And that's why residents filled Queen's College's auditorium Tuesday night to learn more about Atlantis Paradise Island Resort's intention to acquire a water aerodome license to reinstate domestic seaplane operations near Montague Bay. Obviously there is activity in Montague Bay already with um, regattas and recreational sailing and sailing lessons and all of that that has to be factored in. And so we are intending to address those comments uh, in a report back to the Port Department, and the Port Department will have to make a determination. Atlantis's goal? Creating a very high-end excursion to the family islands for its guests, which Senior Vice President of Government Affairs and Special Projects, Vaughn Roberts assures, will open the door to bolster tourism nationwide. Job creation, he says, is also important. The seaplane operator will create jobs, the ferry boat operator will create jobs, and then the, all of the excursions to the family islands would be done by excursion operators in those islands. So there would, the seaplane would be met by a boat that picks up the folks and takes them for the island excursion. And so there's an opportunity for restaurants and all that stuff to make, make uh, money off of this. Well, government's also got a keen eye on this project. There is a, 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 an airport at the moment where seaplanes can launch from. Uh, if they find a suitable area elsewhere, uh, no doubt the, there will be a further consultation and the regulators will, will chime in. This is a matter for the regulators, let me be uh, very clear, and uh, they will make a technical recommendation to, uh, to the minister and the cabinet of the Bahamas, but that's the order in which it, 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 it will go. The venture is also getting endorsement from Bahamas Hotel Tourism Association President Robert Sands. Uh, as the president of the Bahamas Hotel and Tourism Association, it's important that we support member hotels in their ventures to drive business to the Bahamas. Atlantis officials maintain finding the right location is important for safety in order to successfully reinstate this seaplane service. For the Bahamas Tonight, I'm Alta Viz Mannings. Hello everyone, I'm Fern Carey. Thank you for watching our YouTube page. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for all things said and asked.